In the previous lessons, we have retrieved data from data views in OCS, specifically wind turbine data. Uh, we have also created uh, correlation plots to figure out which uh, attributes or which values are affecting the active power because ultimately we want to predict the active power in the next few days. Uh, and based on that, we have found out that active power is correlated closely to wind speed and air temperature. Uh, so we have brought in that data and we have cleansed the data set and we came out with this uh, clean data set, uh, which is showing that when the wind speed increases, uh, the active power increases with it. So what we're going to do in, in this lesson is create a machine learning model based on this filtered out data set. And so basically th that model will uh, include uh, inputs and, and outputs. So the output for that model will be the active power and the inputs will be the air temperature and wind speed. Uh, so the idea is to build that model uh, using existing uh, Python libraries. Uh, now the way we, we're not going to get into more a lot uh, of details into how to create machine learning models because that's outside the scope of this course. Uh, we, we're going to use uh, a decision tree model, but uh, you can use uh, different models for different use cases, or you can use something like uh, AutoML, uh, which can check different machine learn, try different uh, machine learning models, and then give you the best model. Uh, but we're not going to get into that into this course. Uh, the idea is just to show you uh, how we get data from OCS and how to use it.